Sherry has been Lisa's best friend for years and years. She thinks, even as babies, they were friends when their moms took them to the park. Lisa has been Sherry's best friend forever. Sherry is a bit wild, or so her mom says. She's not always an easy person. She knows that. But Lisa has been always her best friend. They cried together, they laughed together. They thought nothing would ever change. But then... So, what do you think of Alan? He's cute, but he's not really my type, and he hangs after the wrong crowd. Like who? You know, the ones who never get invited to parties, like his friend Dylan. You know him, don't you? Yeah, he's in my art class, and I quite like him. Oh, come on Lisa, I don't really fancy Dylan, do you? I didn't say that, did I? But he's very interested to talk to. Okay, if you say so. Anyway, they're the wrong crowd for me. And what's the right crowd for you then? Jamie and his friends. What? <laughs> the football lads? You can't be serious. They keep their brains in their boots. I don't care. They've got nice legs. And Jamie's very good looking. Don't you think? But Sherry, all the guys can talk about is football. I don't care. Yeah, I can imagine. Anyways, you know that he and Jenny are an item, don't you? And you don't think that I can take away from Jenny, do you? I didn't say that, did I? But I mean, why should Jamie be interested in a 15 year old? We'll see, Lisa. We'll see. Sherry, you're not going to do anything stupid, are you? Do I ever? Oh, look who's here. What? Are you kidding me? Does she come with your boyfriend or something? Uh, no, I don't think so. Wait, maybe she accompanied your sister? Let's ask her. Hey. hey, is your sister invited to? What are you talking about? Didn't you see your sister? Hey, you brought your sister with you? Your sister is crazy. What the heck are you doing here? I'm too busy. Oh seriously, it's my business. Go home now, you're embarrassing me. Why should you be embarrassed by a sister like me? Oh, you're a psycho. Go home now. Emily, just leave it alone. You should listen to your friend. What? You just went there? Yeah, why not? You crashed the party? I've never heard of anybody already crashing a sixth form party. Well, I'm not just anybody. Am I? Still. Why didn't they kick you out? Jamie took care of me. Jamie? Yeah, I kind of bumped into him. He spilled coke on my shirt. Oh no, sorry, sorry, I didn't see you. Don't worry, Jamie, it was my fault. I didn't know you knew I six formers. What are you doing here? Do you mind me being here? No, I don't mind. Well, I suppose you're okay then. I guess it is. So we talked a bit. Where was Jenny all this time? Jenny couldn't come to the party. Where is Jenny tonight? She's away on a course, part of her studies, I think. Away? Really? I didn't know. So you're here all on your own? Well, yes, I suppose I am. So we danced a bit and we kissed a bit. Sarah, are you crazy or something? What if Jenny finds out? Why should she? Jamie doesn't have to tell her. Do you? I guess not. But the others saw you, didn't they? Well, just the dancing, not the kissing. Come on, Lisa, don't spoil it. Look out, Jean is coming, and I don't think she's here to wish you happy birthday. I'm only going to say this once, keep away from Jean. What are you talking about? Well, normally, she wouldn't talk to a little nobody like you. But people said I should, so I hope you get the idea, keep away from her. And doesn't he have a say too? Which part of keep away from her don't you understand? I'm warning you, leave him alone. You better not miss my friend, you heard my friend, you heard. We'll see. Sure, you heard her. You've got to forget about Jane. Oh, have I? Yes. Look, are you coming to the rap show with me on Saturday? No, I can't. I'm grounded. I could phone your mom and beg her to let you go. Tell her I've already got the tickets. It's not worth it. What makes you think she'd listen to you anyway? Hey, Sherry, what's the matter? I'm just trying to help. 
You don't have to rescue me all the time. All right, sorry I said that. That's okay. Look, I've got to go. See you around. Think about Saturday. I'll ring you. Bye. Hi, Emily. Hi, Lisa. How are things? Just fine, thanks. Can I talk to Sherry, please? Sorry, Lisa. She's not in. She went to a party. I'm surprised you're not together. Is everything all right? Yes, sure. I've got a ticket to a concert. Do you remember which party? Carol. Carol Fielding. You know her, don't you? Yes, no worries then. Call her mobile number. I did. It switched off. Lisa, is everything all right? Are you two okay? Something must be wrong. What do you mean? How come you're not together? You used to be so close. Never mind. Everything's cool. Thanks a lot. Bye. Bye. How Carol? What are you talking about? You lied to me. You said you're grounded. How do you know? I found your place. I tried your mobile first, but it was switched off. Okay, I lied. I'm sorry. But why Carol? I mean, you don't even like her and she doesn't like you. Why go to her party? I didn't. But your sister... I told my sister I was at Carol's, but I wasn't. So where were you? I went to Jamie at his house. What? I don't believe it. Didn't Jenny tell you to keep away? Didn't Jenny tell you to keep away? Anyway, she's out of town. But what she's going to say when she gets back? Say about what? We're not going to tell her anything. Jamie said we should keep it a secret from Jenny. And you agree? Yeah, why shouldn't I? He's so cool. But it's wrong. Damn it, Lisa, stop telling me what to do. Now it's wrong with Jamie too. Don't you see? He's cheating on Jenny and he's cheating on you too. That's fine with me, as long as I can see him. Sherry, please. If you're my friend, Lisa, you'd let me be with Jamie and stop talking about it. And if I don't? Well, Jamie's more important to me right now. Are you saying? Yes, I am. Think about it. Bye. How come I never see you on the chair anymore? Well, she got different things to do. I haven't spoken to her for weeks. Pity, she seemed kind of fun. Yeah, she is. I mean, she was. She's hanging out with the football crowd now, isn't she? Yeah, looks like it. I've heard rumors that she's going after Jamie. She'd better be careful. Jenna isn't someone I'd want as an enemy. Well, I hope she knows what she's doing. But Sherry can be pretty tough too. If you say so. Um, Lisa, there is an exhibition of the French sketches and sculptures at the Royal Academy. Were you thinking of going? Yes, I was. Why? I was wondering whether you'd want to have company. Well, I wonder who I could go with. I'm joking, Dylan. I'd love it if you came with me. Really? Really, really. Well, don't worry. It's not a proper date or anything. Don't worry, I'll wear a disguise. You were joking about disguise, weren't you? Of course. Brilliant, see you Saturday then. I'm looking forward to it already. Really? Yes, really. See you Saturday. You mean Sherry didn't phone you? No, she didn't. Why? What happened? Well, Sherry crashed Jenny's party, and when Jenny saw her, she shouted, Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy what are you birthday. doing here? Get her out! But Sherry put up a fight, and she shouted for Jamie. She told everybody, Jamie only loves me! He and Jenny aren't an item anymore! Oh my god, what did Jamie say? What do you think? But Jenny was furious. Tell me whether you love me or not. In front of all the others. Is it true what she is saying? He tried to left off, but Jenny wouldn't let her. I only love you, Jenny. I met you once or twice, but it was nothing serious. You're a liar! You're a liar! Then two of Jamie's friends picked her up and threw her out. Oh no, poor Sherry. Poor Sherry? It was all her fault, wasn't it? Well, all she did was fall in love. That's not a crime, is it? I feel a bit sorry for her, I must say. I guess you're right. They thought nothing would ever change, but things have changed. Does that mean you can lose a friend so easily, just because of a boy, a boy like Jamie? Maybe I should phone 
I've made a real fool of myself, and I need someone to talk to about it. But I've lost my best friend too. Maybe I'll call her, maybe she'll listen to me. Friends make your life beautiful. Friends fill your life with the smiles.